Welcome back to The Winning Leap. Now we've talked a lot about how technology will be a universal change maker. It's now time to show you exactly what we mean. At the Apollo hospitals across the country, doctors have access to technology which is revolutionizing healthcare delivery in India. Take a look. Apollo hospitals have set an example by leveraging cutting edge technology for safe and effective healthcare. The group has introduced the most advanced CyberKnife robotic radio surgery system bringing an unparalleled approach to treating inoperable tumors. Revolutionizing preventive healthcare is the adoption of mobile applications to monitor heart rate and ECG rhythm by the patients themselves. Apollo hospitals have always prioritized the adoption of cutting edge technology to cement their status as leaders in the healthcare sector. I'm here with Sangeeta Reddy who's going to talk to us a little bit about their policies on technology and staying on the cutting edge. Ms Reddy, welcome to the show. Thank you. Good to be here. Great. Uh let's start with a basic question. So Apollo hospitals have always prioritized the adoption of cutting edge technology. So why is it important for you to constantly innovate with your technology? Well basically the philosophy has always been the same which is enable bringing the best to patients in India making it affordable and reaching out and treating as many patients as possible and as technology evolves we need our own systems and our uptake of technology to grow and stay abreast and that's what we followed over the last 32 years i think we've not only been the pioneers in bringing in whether it was the pet ct or the ct mr uh and even now i think we will be the first ones in asia to bring in the proton therapy so we continue to adopt technology which is appropriate for the indian healthcare system and find ways to make it accessible to our people great and you've touched upon it a little bit but can you tell us about some of the more innovative technologies that you've used both in medical and uh, healthcare in diagnostic or early detection i think one of my new favorites and there are a lot of them but one of my new favorites uh is really the non invasive diabetes screening okay uh so everybody hates to be poked yeah but you need to poke someone to find out if they have diabetes and india is the diabetes capital of the world so this is a simple scan where you put your hands and your feet and based on the signaling and your uh, of your sweat glands we can do an early detection of whether oh, the individual wow. is diabetic uh, i must talk about robotic surgery because i mean the you know all of us see hi-fi and space yeah. and robot robots are not taking over the theater but what they are doing are becoming an enhanced tool for the surgeon okay and finally i must talk about you know technology which is enabling all this from you know doctors with ipads we message from our machines the lab testing yeah. machine to our hospital information system to a doctor's phone okay. so the speed to his reacting to yeah. a patient is far far yeah. quicker and better and that's why we have some of the best outcomes the miraculous cures because there's so much science and technology behind the work Absolutely that sounds really <laughs> fascinating but were there any challenges you faced at the time of implementation and installation of the technology customs duty the lack of awareness yeah. no engineers to really support it in the beginning uh higher prices because the installed base was low we've been through all these curves but i think now india is a pretty level playing field in terms of adoption of technology Is it okay so that really leads me to the next question why is it that more healthcare institutions and hospitals aren't really adopting it or maybe not yet at least number one there is a cost and because we are you know unfortunately in a country where universal health coverage hasn't become a reality people have to pay out of pocket and when you do that uh, use of technology enhances the bills and therefore doctors are always striving to keep the bills low so first priority would be for the medical consult second would be for medication and diagnostics comes a little later it's the ecosystem to enable it's insurance to enhance accessibility and affordability it's a larger installed base even further installed base it's technicians who can run the machines so that you're using them well it's training for doctors all these are you know kind of hurdles in the path of greater availability of technology but again i will say i'm the eternal optimist and i think we've come a long way that's great can you tell us clearly what are the benefits you've experienced first hand from the adoption of technology both in terms of your patients as well as the staff it's safer care it's better care 
So, if you have a spine surgery with uh, a spine robot, so you can have some technology or you can have, you know, the beautiful high-end robot ensuring precision and you definitely get better outcomes uh, when you have a trained doctor a good team working with the robot yeah. then you're going to get the best for the patient to our staff we have a learning management system so our training systems are very high we've tried to make training cool which in healthcare is not so easy but uh, we actually have a clinical playstation okay. so all new employees or new family members go in and they learn in uh, the the Apollo equivalent of the PlayStation. So it's a combination of videos and tools and questions. And so we tried to make training fun. And, uh, and through that, I think we're creating better professionals who are doing an absolutely amazing job. Great. That sounds really inspiring. Thank you so much, Ms. Reddy, for being on the show today. It's been a pleasure. Well, on that note, it's clear that aggressive investment in technology for growth is the need of the hour, and the government must take heed of our billion-strong, evolving consumer base and take their cues from the digital world. Focus. Ideation. Innovate. Enable.